everyone, how are you? It's Leah Cross with the Mortgage Center. Really quick blog for you. And the question is, should I get pre-approved first or should I go shopping first? And I don't know why this is always a question, but here's a scenario to lay out for you. If you were to go shopping for a house and fall in love with a place that cost $500,000 and you make an offer and it gets accepted, and then you go to your bank and you say, okay, here's this house, it's $500,000, but the bank says, okay, that's, that's fabulous, I'm glad you found a home, but you actually only qualify for $400,000. Now your heart's broken, the family's disappointed, and you, know, you don't get the house that you've fallen in love with. As well, the seller, who's now making plans based on the fact that they have an accepted offer, has those plans fall through. So, not a great situation for anybody, and definitely a, a situation you don't want to put yourself in. So, 100% yes. And in fact, if you're working with a realtor, oftentimes they won't even look at you until you have been pre-approved first, because they too don't want to waste their time as well, okay? So, if you are looking to buy a home, you must, must, must get pre-approved first. Find out how much you can even shop for, okay? And so the, the simple scenario of how a mortgage process should go is you should get pre-approved first. Then once you know how much you can go shopping for, if it's $400,000, you tell your realtor, your realtor takes you shopping for $400,000. You make an offer on that home. If it's accepted, then typically you have a subject removal timeline of five to seven or 10 business days. If you have a really great realtor, it'll be multiple days after that. Um, but you'll have subject removal. Then you come back to me, we do the final um, approval, so you've been pre-approved only. A pre-approval is not an approval, okay? So important for you to know that. So you get pre-approved, you go shopping, you get an accepted offer, then you get fully approved, and then you buy your home, okay? So that's the simple scenario as to how you buy a home. So for all of you first-time home buyers out there, or even people who are buying for, you know, 10 times over, if you've already done this 10 times before, but you still haven't, caught on that being pre-approved first is going to make your life a lot easier, I'm definitely suggesting that you do that. Now, whether you get pre-approved by me or another mortgage broker or a bank, just get pre-approved. So that way, at least your heart's not broken when you find out you can't get the house that you really want. Okay? So if you have any questions or if you would like to get pre-approved, I can do that right over the phone. A pre-approval is just me going over your numbers and then me calculating uh, what a lender would approve you at. Okay? And I can do that right on the phone and it would only take us about 10 to 15 minutes. You can give me a call. My contact info is on the website. If you have any other questions, of course, feel welcome to give me a call or email. Leah Haas with the Mortgage Center.